Happy Force Friday, everybody. I got my tux on because it's a special occasion. In case you're living under a rock somewhere, today at uh, midnight, uh, all around the country, everyone was going crazy trying to get their hands on some Star Wars loot. As you can see, we got some of our own. Even the crown jewel of the BB-8. Thank you, BestBuy.com, for allowing me to order that at like 5 o'clock this morning so I actually could go to bed before midnight. Yeah! Anyways, um, the BB-8's mine. These two Legos and the Chewbacca, those belong to Mr. Sason. And this one, the Disney Infinity I bought for my son, I was going to hold it back for Christmas. But let's face it, I want to play it too, because I'm a big stupid kid. Anyways, my son Sean, he's going to guest star for his first unboxing. He's going to unbox that for you guys. So, basically, let's get started and play with some toys. Okay, so... We're going to start out first with Disney Infinity, but let me introduce you to my son, Sean. Sean, say hi to all the two people probably watching this. It's probably Grandma and Grandpa, since they're supporters of what I do. So, so Sean is going to do unbox Disney Infinity 3.0 first. So here is Disney Infinity, no longer Disney Infinity, more like Star Wars Infinity. Yeah, for those of you who don't know, uh, Disney 1.0 is just strictly all Disney and Pixar. 2.0 brought yeah, in the Marvel, Marvel superheroes, and, and then 3.0 will have we got Star, Age, Wars. Star Wars and Age of Ultron, so that's exciting. So Sean, let's go ahead and crack this bad boy open. Yeah, wait. Okay, and so what do you guys show everybody? All right. So, um, so we got the 3.0 game. Let's get this bad boy. Um, and then we have this right here, the Ultron. Oh, yes, Disney. Thank you for your your blocking that button. All black and white. You know, the portal. Thank yeah. you, Disney, for taking even more of my money. But at least you had the decency not to charge eighty dollars this time, and it was only sixty-five. You're welcome, Josh. <laughs> but see, there's the so, portal um, in the game. Portal never change. Um. Yeah. Well, let's face it. Here's the meat and potato of why Disney Infinity is so great. The Disney property figure. So, with the starter pack, we got Anakin Skywalker. Yeah. Um. I think there is a lot of detail to this. I mean, good, cool, and then right here. I never remember her name. She's from Clone Wars. She was his Padawan. That's the best you're going to get from me. Yeah. Hello, everybody. I'm Nelson, and I got Chewbacca. It's awesome. I also got this Lego set, but, you know, unboxing that probably wouldn't work very well because... I'd have to put together. I'm it's gonna be messy. messy. It's <laughs> gonna be messy. So, Chewbacca comes in this deluxe little packaging. Uh, at least I should hope so, with as much as it costs. Twelve dollars for something like this. They used to be five when I was a kid. No, those were ten. All right, they were ten, according to the off-camera voice. So let's uh, crack this open. I have my opening tool right here. So. As we can see here, this is a, what is it, three and a quarter, four, four inches. Oh, it's Chewbacca. I guarantee it's like four or five inches. Yeah. But this is a pretty cool uh, little figurine. I, I actually kind of like it a little bit better than the original ones, just because it looks like it has a little bit more detail. That and I can open these. I can't open the other ones without, you know, killing millions and millions of nerds in one fell swoop. It's like a disturbance in the force or something. It comes with this little armor... Which, I'm hoping it's actually in the new movie, but let's face it, it probably isn't. Because they like to do things like that. So, this goes over top like that. He's got his crossbow. And I think that's a pretty cool little, uh, little figure that's going to go on my desk at work. Along with many other, other nerdy things. And then, this Lego set, I will just show off a little bit here. It's one of the little micro fighters. It is a mini AT-80 -AT that comes with a, I believe that's a shock trooper. Oh no, that's an AT-80 -AT driver. All right then. Now, let me get comfortable. So, the Coupe de Graffy. The toy everyone wanted, and I'm, I'm going to be honest with you, uh, loyal reader, or I guess viewer, I can't call you loyal reader on the YouTubes, can I? No, it's going to be loyal. I read the YouTube. Shut up, Nelson. Anyways, um, the BB-8. Like I said, I ordered this at like 5 in the morning off BestBuy.com. 
and got store pickup. That's what really surprised me. When I was like, shoot, I'll take it. When I got the Best Buy, this was literally the last one they had when they put it back on the shelf. So I got kind of lucky. Uh, a lot of people on Facebook are jealous. Um, so use the trusty Batarang to cut this tape. Unlike my son, I'm going to keep this box in good condition because I'm a hoarder. This box is going to go in my attic because I keep these things. And then I'll throw it away in like 20 years when I move. But here we go. You can see... This is made by uh, Sphere.com. I think uh, if you're familiar, these guys were selling a ton of like rolling ball robots at uh, comic conventions. Well, ooh, look, look how fancy that is. We got a box and a box and another box. I feel I feel like uh, the dude from uh, Tropic Thunder played by Robert Downey Jr. But there we go. A little plastic cover to uh, keep BB-8. Oh, this is pretty. That's in there good. Ooh. And the ball comes off. So I'm definitely going to have to read these directions before I play with it. And then we got the little head right there. Oh, good. USB charging port. I can see the USB symbol there. See, we got the little head. Oh, it's got a little ball underneath of it there. A little tab thing that's going to sit just like that. I cannot wait to play with this. And I've got a dog. She's going to freak out. All right, let's see how the dog likes him. Taylor. No shits were given, apparently. So, the set BB-8 there. We got the little charging port down here. And by the way, this is really nice foam they packed in. They want to keep this safe. And they better for the $150 they charge for it. But here's the charging port right here. It's got the USB charger, mini USB charger right there you can see that at home star wars logo you're gonna sit bb8 right there and he's gonna charge she's gonna charge i don't know could it be a girl it could be a girl i was assumed r2 was a boy and we'll assume bb8 is a boy i don't know it's a droid so droids are not phenomenal so let's see if i can sit that right there on the couch from the app store and the google play store you can um download the app to go on your smartphone right here and uh, play with the droid. I haven't even done that yet because I'm just unboxing it now. And um, I've got the Android phone, so obviously Google Play, but I've also got an iPad. So I'm going to see if I can download that to my iPad as well and have two controls for it so I can play with whatever. But that is the BB-8, the, the big thing for today. Uh, also, I pre-ordered Battlefront. Uh, that will come out soon. I can't wait to get that. We'll get a review up there on clashofthenerds.com for you guys but uh thanks for watching this don't forget to like the video subscribe below come back for more unboxing more reviews and everything like that thank you and have a great day